Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Welcome to part 3 of episode 4 of Pharaoh's Tomb for the PC, brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright. We're in this place now, which I'm just gonna call it. Just this place. Grab a key. Not to a good start. Well, I can't be able to grab it from there. I have to go up this way. Because I can't really crawl. There's no crawl feature in this game. Okay, I got one key, and I have to grab that one, and then I'm done. Okay, well, that's not too bad. I'm gonna need the time freeze, though, to dodge those shots. Okay, that's perfect. The bat won't be in the way. Okay, now I gotta climb up and fast. Perfect. Didn't have to use a spear. Okay, now I gotta make this jump just right. Perfect. The treasure room! Oh, it's not the last level? Oh. Huh. It had a last level feel. Okay, can I grab this this way? Yes, I can. Oh, I fucked up. I forgot about those spears and those spikes on the right. Okay, well, that's perfect. Yeah, I'll just hold the jump button so I can see whatever points I can get here. Okay, now I gotta do another freeze. There's not going to be enough time on this one to grab the treasure. There. That should do it. Oh, that was close. Alright, another freeze. So I'm grab the key, grab the spear, grab the freeze, and I'm out of here. Hey, that rhymes! Hey, fuck you, Mother Goose. I'm better than you. Okay, was that a good idea? Yeah, it is. As long as I'm not one pixel too far to the right. Okay, good. That's all. The jackal room. Uh, do I see anything that resembles jackals? Well, if it wasn't a jackal the first time, why the hell would it be the other 13 times? Thank you, family guy. Okay, is this a good idea? Yeah, it is. In fact, it was the only idea. That was my best choice. Alright, now I'll just grab the key and the next scroll to unravel these blocks. Now I should be able to finish. I don't think I need to kill that fire. Unless I absolutely feel like it. Uh-oh. Be fast, be fast. The Chamber of Destiny. Nope, oh, nope, that's not the last level yet. God, how many levels did I beat and how many more do I need to do? Well, then again, if I already know one answer, I should know the second. It's like, you, I've done 14 levels. You have six left. Uh, okay, good. I didn't want to walk into spikes looking like a dumbass. Like, what's over here, Dad? Okay, I think I can grab this key without killing the enemies. There. And wait. Wait, no. And we're done. The Great Temple. Eh, we still got a way to go. What's so great about this great temple? Like the other places were just semi-great or something? Or mediocre great? I'll grab this one at. That way it'll keep the shot on screen for a little bit longer. Not that I really need it anyway. So I won't be going back down there. At least I would hope not. Nope, there was no trigger here. Eh, uh, better wait. I'll destroy this. 
Okay, was that a good idea? Didn't really do me any favors. Unless I had to be up here. And apparently I did. Now I can grab the key and get out. Yeah, you gotta use your head in this type of game. You gotta use your head. Or you can use game facts. Actually, I don't think there are any walkthroughs on this on game facts. This is a very primitive game. So I don't think a lot of people have played it now. The Pharaoh's Anteroom. Okay, I see all three treasures at once. This can only mean one thing. Shit. No, wait, 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 wait. There's another thing. Maybe this can help me out. Double shit. I can't even get up there anyway. Uh, let's see. I guess I can just fall down here. I bet you this is a trick. The Pharaoh's Tomb. Oh, okay, okay. This is the last level. Now, let's see. Uh, do I activate this? I mean, I don't get on the spikes. Thank you, Nevada. No, no, that's not gonna help me. I can't get up there. I think I'll just have to. Let's figure this one out. Um. Well, I guess I can go down, and grab that scroll, and then leave. I guess I can do this. Let's see if that's a good idea. I am in the final level after all. I want to finish this with style. Okay, grab it. Get out. Get out. Thank you. Uh, is this gonna work? It better work. Ah, yes it will. In fact, that could be all I need. Once I grab the key, I can get out. Well, then I actually gotta grab a second key. That one shouldn't be too bad. There. Uh, do I have to make a big jump to get this? Oh! I'll eventually have to anyway. So I'll kill this enemy. Oh, that was close. Just imagine I died there. Why is that mummy green? Is this the Incredible Hulk or something? Or Dipsy from Teletubbies? End of the road. You finally found it. Breathing easily for the first time in weeks, you sit down and relax against the wall. Reaching into your pack, you pull out a knife and cut off a small piece of the shroud the pharaoh was wrapped in. You will need it for proof of your findings. You mark the tomb's location on your map and prepare to leave the pyramid. It's funny, but this place has become like a home to you on your journey. It saddens you to leave it, but you must return and tell the world of your findings. Later, it is midnight. You walk quietly through the office and up to the man whose back is to you. Working late tonight, Professor? The Professor spins around in his chair, startled. So you've returned, he says quietly. Yes, you say, tossing in the shroud. Ah, a triumphant return of that, at that. Well done, Nevada. I congratulate you. You stand there, stunned by this unexpected reaction. I've been thinking that maybe I could use an associate on my future adventures. Maybe you. What do you think? Why not? You reply, shrugging your shoulders. As long as I get half the credit, you add. Certainly, Nevada. You've proved your, you deserve it, says the professor. Thanks, Professor Jones. Professor Jones? You say as you walk out of the dimly lit office and into the night air. The end. I hope you enjoyed this series coming in 1991. Nevada Smith and Journey to the Center of the Earth. And that's it. That's Pharaoh's Tomb for the PC. It's all over. Every single episode has been completed. About fucking time. There. That's a good way to end this. So stay tuned for my next Let's Play, which is going to be Tempo for the Sega 32X. Anyways, this is the Bonga signing off saying goodbye, Godspeed, and stay tuned for my next Let's Play.